Hi guys, in today's video, we're gonna grow orange trees. We need a couple of fresh oranges from the market. Choose oranges that have firm, fine textured skin. Avoid oranges that feel spongy or have soft spots. Scrape the rind at the root of the fruit. Then remove the flower stalk at the, the top. Rub onion juice over the scraped area. Onion has natural root stimulants such as auxin. Auxin promotes cell growth and the formation of roots. Let's repurpose this used plastic bottle into a handy mixing container. Raw egg is high in protein and encourages strong growth. Next, add the aloe vera gel. This gel has antibacterial and antifungal properties to protect from pathogens. Pour liquid fertilizer into the mix. Once mixed, it has a milky, creamy appearance. Ladle a couple of teaspoons into glass cups. We'll add extra fertilizer for a nutritional boost. Then dilute with water and fill to the brim. Place the orange's root down into the cup. Once inserted, cover and set aside. Here's a fact for you. Oranges contain more vitamin C than any other fruit. Look here, after only 20 days, they've sprouted. Check out the growth on these root systems. Now they're ready to replant. Oranges are a nutritional powerhouse, packed with vitamins and minerals. They contain antioxidants which have many health benefits. Here's a great hack to keep your work surface clean. Simply wrap with cling film for a temporary cover. Coir aerates soil, which allows plant roots to breathe and grow. Here's a tip to stop soil from going under your fingernails. Now we'll mix together.
This blend brings a versatile combination of water retention and natural drainage. Place a sponge in the bottom of the tub. Sponges slowly release water, keeping the moisture level steady. After filling, plant the seedling. Did you know orange trees have a lifespan of over 50 years? Check out the results from the soap pack. And our tip for a quick clean surface. Deeply water newly planted young citrus trees about once or twice a week. But don't overwater. Amazingly, oranges contain more than the recommended daily amount of vitamin C. That's more than any other citrus fruit. Around 50 days later, the plants have grown stronger. Misting leaves encourages pollination of the flowers. Citrus plants like humid environments, so misting keeps them cool too. They're also hungry plants and need regular feeding. It's best to feed every second watering. Seven months later, the trees should produce fruit. As the fruit matures, it develops chlorophyll. This is vital for photosynthesis and allows fruit to absorb energy from the sun. That's how they develop their orange color. This hack avoids overwatering plants. Place small ice blocks on the soil. The gradual melting allows the soil and roots to absorb the water. It'll keep plants happy and hydrated. Did you know that orange, the fruit, came before the color? The color came about 200 years later than the fruit. The color used to be referred to as yellow-red. This citrus superfood boosts your immune system and improves your heart health. An orange a day will keep the doctor away.
Thanks and see you soon.